Hi, 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 Bernie here from sunny San Diego. What's up, you guys, and welcome to our latest Freedom Cast about Ansel's business continuity suite. What is business continuity? Well, it's basically um, what it says. You want your business to run continuously, even if a server goes down, be it a cloud server or an on-premises server, if it goes down, you don't want your business to have any downtime. You want to have it run continuously. And um, I'm going to show you how Ansel solves that important problem. So part of the problem is taking backups. And the other part of the equation is getting those backups restored and getting alternative resources if one of your resources goes down and restoring the backup there and just continuing your business. So let's get right into it. We have our Ansel here, Ansel server called Aster, logging in. And um, we see the dashboard here, some basic information about the server. We see um, our antlets here. Let's check the full antlet list. And um, we see an antlet here named uh, Blanco. Um, so and besides each outlet, we see that little backup icon here. So that's how easy it is to take a backup. Just click on that icon here. Um, we see one backup here that we already took. Um, let's take another backup. So we just go to backup now. We can backup to the Ansel Cloud or to some self-managed storage. Self-managed storage means you provide the storage space. So that could be your local space on your server. It could be some external drive that you attached, um, some um, NFS mount, or it could even be on another server that is accessed through SSH. So if we click on self-managed here, you see the destination path, or there could be an SSH host um, where we can store the data so but what i want to show you now is the ansel cloud so you can back it up to the ansel cloud and uh, the backup will now be taken um, we see here backing up which takes only a few seconds here because the backup is really small after it's backed up it's being uploaded to the ansel cloud see that here um, it's uploading right now and now the backup has been successfully taken. It's been uploaded to the Ansel Cloud. You see it here. So now we have two backups um, that we've taken. All right. So that is backups. By the way, the, the space included in the Ansel Cloud, it's 2000 gigabytes in the scale plan um, that we have here on this server. So each tier gives you a different amount of cloud storage that is included. So now we have this new tab here. It's called Heal Antlets. So let's click that one. Um, so it tells us as long as you have a backup, you can heal it here. All backups connected to your Anthill account are available to restore. That is super important. We can restore backups even on other physical servers. So that means you can have a backup that was taken on one server and you can restore it on the other one as long as all your servers are managed through one Anthill account. And by the way, we see the Blanco backup here um, that we've taken. But the cool thing is, let's go to a different server. So this is a different server called Iris and um, we see that backup on iris as well if we go to heal antlets here same thing and see what's on there we see that blanco backup here as well or both of them um so does both of them and um, we can restore them here as well so now i've talked about two parts taking backups restoring them restoring them even on a different machine the third part is the automatic monitoring and provisioning of other instances. So what we actually do here with our business continuity suite, we monitor your server constantly 
so we know when it's down because it doesn't respond to to our pings um, and then we automatically provision a cloud instance for you and that is a complete dedicated server you know at no extra cost it's all included in those business plans and then we restore the latest backup into that cloud instance the cloud instance is running edge linux so it's like an ansel and your apps are running there until we fix the problem on the on-premises server so that is continuity at its best so the best way to get as much continuity as possible is to smash that like button because it helps the YouTube algorithm, it means a lot to me, and it advances our movement, which is really important to keep things going. So please do me a favor, hit that like button. So things don't end here. It's not only we provision um, that other uh, server in the cloud, um, that is called heal to cloud, very unique feature. Um, but we can also do heal to peer. So you can set things up in a way that if Astro goes down running your, your antlet, then it will automatically be provisioned on Iris on, a, on another on-premises server. The backup will be restored there and it will run there continuously. So that is business continuity. Thank you so much for watching. Please comment down below what you think about it. What features do you need in your use case? What other questions do you have? And I promise I'll answer each and every one of these comments personally. All right, thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.